Well, good morning. Welcome to day two. Very, very different weather-wise, is. isn't it? Yeah. It's there's no wind. Big bonus because that side wind yesterday was just savage. It really was. I just ruined everything. Really, mm. didn't it? Um, it's calm right off, which is obviously a big plus down here because it fishes a lot better when it's calmer. Um, Mm -hmm. The only thing we've got to hope now is that dreaded weed that appeared yesterday doesn't make an appearance today, or nor as bad as yesterday, hopefully yeah. anyway, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. We've got high water at the days about an hour late, around about 10. So we're going to have at least an hour of the flood, an hour back. And we're just speaking to another lad who fished around here yesterday, and he said the weed didn't, didn't start becoming a problem until about three hours in. So we're hoping we might get at least three hours of, of reasonable fishing. Yeah. We're, we're down at Alborough. We're a bit higher up the day because when the last time we were here, even at high water on a small tide, you could still get a bit of beach. Yeah. Whereas it's no chance. It's just all fishing off these grass ledges, really, which do do look a bit precarious. It has <laughs> yeah. to be said. But uh, hopefully, there's enough yeah. mass in the soil behind us here to uh, prevent a slip. So I think we're both just saying before, tactics are gonna be alternate between worm baits on a loop rig and squid and bluey on a pulley for a rape. Yeah, yeah. The way in yesterday was very, very low, shall we say. Um, so, yeah. you know, you're still within a chance today. If you get a good couple of, couple of decent fish today, it's gonna to bang you right up the top of that table. So it's yeah. all to play for, yeah. definitely. And it's, you know, looking up and down the coast, what, what happened yesterday and where the fish were, it just seemed to be just a little scattering just randomly so it's a bit of a lottery i just mm. think it's just a lot of luck today isn't it yeah really? definitely but the middle beaches around here it's got to be as good as anywhere we've got a little bit of an advantage in that we're above the sea so we can probably get a little bit more distance hopefully we can hold bottom feeling a lot more confident than what we felt yesterday aren't we yeah yesterday was challenging <laughs> It was, <laughs> yeah. it was to say the least. Yeah. We've had a bit more of a militant start of the day. It was a bit leisurely yesterday. We're up a lot earlier this morning. We've got a, we've got a spot that we're pretty happy with. So. Yeah, it's as good as anywhere, isn't it? So. Yeah, we've got about 50 minutes or so till, uh, till kick off. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. bang so on 50 minutes. We had some bait, some, oh, I can never get that right. Some rigs baited up, probably in about 45, 40 minutes or so. Get them fired out and hopefully start a different type of day. Yep. So hopefully come back here with some fish. It's rattling like, isn't it? Well, there is the first fish of the day. I think we might have something small on here. Yeah? Saw a couple of rattles before, I mean, tiny. Yeah, just see something pop up out there. First fish of the day. Definitely undersized. Not looking too healthy at all. Don't know what's going on with his eye. But it's a fish to start. Let's get another bait out. Two hours in, we've had an undersized white in each, and that's pretty much it. It's 
pretty challenging so far. Tide's ebbing a bit quicker than, uh, than what we thought it might actually, so. But it's a really pleasant day. It's nice, very still. The sea's flattened off a lot. There's a bit of a residual swell, but it's not too bad at all. Pretty sure I've just had a few little rattles on you. fish on here. Maybe one and a bit of... I had two on there, like, I think the other one just fell off in the surf. Wasn't, wasn't big, like. Second fish, still under size, unfortunately, but it's a fish. Oh, he's taking that. Little white, and he's taking that worm, that worm bait very deeply, but just need something a bit bigger. beach. Just had my third fish of the day, which was a, what well, is absolutely massive rock one. Get him back and get another bait out. This whole coastline changed massively it's been a year since me and Gary being down and on this beach on Albra on a small tide in this particular area you used to be able to get a bit of beach still and you just about can now but you can see the water's right up to the cliffs and we've been stood on top for the first three hours of the match so on a bigger tide you'd definitely be chased back up but coastal erosion around here is just incredible earlier on, wasn't sure if it was anything on there, I just wound in and little fella there, with a little white, nowhere near big at all, tiny, it's not been one of them days, but it's a fish, but 
might be there too, we'll just get it straight for All right, well, weeds appeared. There's still a few whiting out there, Where? albeit small. It's fish number four. Nice red colours on them, but you'll be undersized. Nicely conditioned, I'll just measure them out of interest. Yep, he's about 32, so. Got another bait out, we've got about an hour or so left. Well, it is nearly five to two. I've had four fish, three white in a rock, and then Gary's had a couple of white and tides drop off quite a lot now. Lads further down or probably gain another 30, 40 yards on us. We seem to be in the deepest part of this, this channel, but it's, uh, it's been very, very tricky. It's been a very pleasant day to fish, but nothing in terms of any size fish, even white. And, no cod, no rays. Apparently there's a 10 pounder somewhere. Same lad who won it last year, so. Sounds like he's gonna be in the, in the money again, so well done. As for everyone else, fair to say it's been very, very challenging. Oh, that's oh aye, that was, that was a better bite. Nothing on. That's bizarre. That. that was really going as well. Yeah. Well, fifth fish, smallest weight and yet just gone 25 to three. So we're gonna get one more cast, and that will be the end of. Or EOBC campaign for 2024. That brings us to the end of yet another fruitless EOBC. <laughs> yeah, we don't have much luck down here, do we? No, no. It's, uh, yeah, it's been much, much more pleasant day from a fishing point of view, not a breath of wind, holding bottom, not really any weed, the odd bit, but yeah. nothing of any significance. I mean, to be honest with you, the sea's dropped right off, still a good bit of colour in here, and David said, the weed gone, I would have expected it to fish a little bit better than what it did, but it's been pretty desolate. Yeah. Up and down the beach, reports coming in, the stretch we're on, there's just nothing really, just undersized white. Yeah. It's, it is what it is. Yeah, it's got, it's been very quiet, we've had, have you, I think I've had four small white in a rock, then you've had a few white and three, I think, three white. It's, yeah, it's been pretty poor, pretty poor. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the video. It's been a few fish, it hasn't been a complete blank. It's been tricky, but it is what it is. So, yeah. till the next time, thanks for watching. Tight lines, keep fishing. We'll see you soon. Cheers. Cheers.